Hey, what's up, guys? I'm Bray Torian. And Jinx here. And welcome back to Stranded Alien Dawn on the PlayStation 5. Alright, so the first thing we're going to be doing in today's episode, somebody told me that we should probably break down the clothes that we have here. Though the spaceship pants are decent. Yeah, those are fine. And they're not even... Yeah, so we should probably keep that. And then maybe find one of our characters that, like, has pant problems. And uh, have him put those on. I would think that Connor would often have pant problems. Well, I was going to put... Hmm. It looks like Quinn's pants need to be switched out. I mean, they're still fine. I let them wear them till, <laughs> till there's nothing left to wear. Well, it starts like uh, notifying you that they're crappy after yeah a certain point. So that's what I was thinking. They need to be changed out. Some of them need new boots. Oh, Connor's throwing up again. He's like, oh, good. Right as he's cooking. That's gross, <laughs> Connor. <laughs> I wonder how long the vomit oh, sticks gross. around for. I didn't even notice that. You didn't know the, vom the, vom the vomit actually stays there? No. All right, so you'll notice we moved these two traps here off to the side because they're able to get through here because it's not close enough to the door. So we need to move it a little bit closer. That doesn't look like I can. Is it because this I is think obstructing? It's obstructing its own. Oh, wow. Oh, no, it's from the gate. So you can't move it any closer to the gate? Mm-mm. Yeah, somebody told me that I needed to move it closer. No, like, I would want to move it closer, but... But you can't? You can't. Okay. Well, the guy who told me that was somebody who's also playing the game, so I assumed... Oh. He knew that I would Like, didn't. can you move it, like, super close to where the cone is, like, oh, like that? It still won't move there. I mean, you can't because of the traps now, but... Yeah, but why wouldn't you be able to move it right here? Because of the gate. Oh, so I see. Right so you there. have to put it like right there. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we'd have to move it, move all these traps then. I see. Or at least two of them, I think. Yeah, I guess we could leave the two on the side. So we'd want to move these, I don't know, just somewhere out here, I guess. Or right here. Just wherever. It doesn't matter. Yeah, we'll get these all deconstructed as well. Uh, oops, not deconstructed. My bad. We want to move them. And you know what? We'll go ahead and move all of them. I don't see the point of having one off to the side of it. We'll just put them all over here. And try and catch them on the outside. I think that makes the most sense. Let's put it right here. There we go. And then that should allow us to then move that forward. So, so he's going to move those traps. Uh, we got the coat. All right, excellent. All right. Who's chilliest? So, I mean, it looks like Quinn needs it the most. Yeah, I think he does. He's got a sweater on currently. We need a sweater and a coat. All right, so let's have him put that on wherever the hell he moved it to. Oh, he hasn't finished yet. Okay, so let's have him. I think he's trying to break that down right now, so let's let him finish that. You can equip him from oh, his okay, okay, I see. thingy. Yeah, yeah. I was gonna let him finish. I thought oh, he was breaking down the stuff doing. that that we put in there. Yeah. So let's. He's off to do more tailoring. Put the coat on him, and have him do that first, so that he can get warmer. What are you doing now, Quinn? He's uh making stuff. We've got him crafting. Oh, okay. I thought he threw the fabric down. Wasn't gonna get more. Yeah, he's making the next coat. So that's a pretty good cold tolerance, right? It is, yeah. That's not bad. So we're going to want to continue working on this over here. I'm just trying to get this done first. Because, yeah, I noticed that some of the bugs were able to move through here. Mm-hmm. Has this not been finished being moved? No. No. All right, so we got to wait. Uh, Laura is at risk of meltdown. Looks like everybody's sleeping. That's what the She's issue is. She's always at risk of meltdown. So not having this done is obviously troublesome. For the fact that uh, that's where we're going to have to put all our heat stuff. I think all of our people are going to freeze to death, honestly. But I don't think they'll freeze to death. <laughs> a loud bang. What was oh, that? No. So the wind carried the sound of a loud bang from the distance. What might it be? Most curious. Did you get that one yet? No. Hmm. 
something new. All right, so now we can move this. Hmm. Oh, does it have to be on the like very all up in it? <laughs> wow. All right. Okay, so do we have to move all the traps? Let me I just think see here. Those two. Just those two, or really just one? It's only on one spot. I guess you could put another flamethrower here. Can they get past it though? If you put two of them, I would think. Yeah, I mean, it seems like maybe they can, but I would just have move the one and see what their mobility is like around it. Yeah, it's just it doesn't block off the whole thing though. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah, that's unfortunate. Okay, whatever. We'll have to move this one then. Yeah, it's kind of a pain. Uh, will it be able to reach that far? Let me see. How far does this thing reach? It's already to the point it doesn't... We might as well just break these traps down then. So yeah, we'll break down this trap here. Deconstruct. Whenever you get to it. No rush, guys. She's it's decided not like to work on this first. Gonna come eat you. Now she's got to go pet Bruno. Because <laughs> <laughs> she is terribly sad. So the trees are losing their leaves. And what's really cool is the leaves really like float through the air and everything as well. Mm. And we got aggressive animals. Let's see where they're at. Oh no, they're over here. With the bay. Are they going to kill those cows? Probably. They're over there, aren't they? Yeah, mm-hmm. They're all sleeping right now, so that's probably the reason why they haven't started killing them. All right, we should just go over there and kill them. Although Connor's sleeping. I'd hate to wake him up from his <laughs> sleep. <laughs> he works so hard. Like, just sleep while you can. Yeah, let's just let him sleep. Do you need to get your flamethrower moved if you're going to move it? Yeah. But we can't until they take that apart and everybody's sleeping. Wake their asses up. It's time to go. You got monsters. <laughs> Look at them. They're attacking all the critters. Oh, are they going to kill the dog? I don't think they went that far. I swear to God, they killed that dog. They might. They're attacking us now. Okay. They're on the And way. everybody's leaving. <laughs> this is great. Wake them up. I don't want to wake them up. It's early enough. The sun's up. <laughs> okay, we'll wake them all up. All right, so this is going to draft everybody up. And, uh, hmm. Yeah, I wanted to get the flamethrower moved. So Take this is what we're going to do. Well, it doesn't even do anything from there, does it? I mean, it might scorch him a little bit. So this is what we're going to do. We're going to undraft Quinn and then have him do the move. So we'll want to... I had him selected. Let's have him run over here and cr really quickly deconstruct the trap. And then let's go get ahead and get everybody else put in place here. So he'll go up here. Oh, why is he not drafted now? I think it says he's unable. I must have undrafted everybody. Everybody. Yeah. Okay, I just want to draft these three. Okay, and then we'll have Quinn go up here. Ember go over here. It's the same places that we had him before. And Laura will go over here. Or well, she'll be in the way if we put her right there. We'll put her right here. Okay. Like so. Hurry, hurry, peoples. Really? No, it's all right. Quinn, you can't go to eat. He's like, I'm no, hungry. Dog. No, I gave you an order. Deconstruct the trap. He's like, I'm so freaking grouchy right now. <laughs> it's like you're the only one that doesn't I have can't to fight. with you. Oh, uh, we're not getting up there quick enough. Mm -mm. This is going to be bad. No, because everybody's just taking their sweet ass time. Okay, that's not going to work, Quinn. <laughs> okay, so Quinn. Yeah, everybody's just going to have to attack. Yeah, you took too long. I mean, you those beetles won't kill you anyway. You've got four people fighting. Yeah. They're going to be all stuck on the traps. But if they take out the towers, I saw what happened when they took out your towers. Yeah, but that wasn't these beetles. <laughs> that was other critters. 
What was it? Those big guys. The big ones that shoot at you and stuff? No, they don't shoot. They just, uh, like, whack with their front hands. Mm-hmm. Well, there's one that shoots at you. The front hoofy thingies. Yeah. Because they were in the tutorial. Those are the scorpion guys. Mm-hmm. Yeah, They're those ones. They're over there by those, like, magma nest looking thingies. How many are left? Is that it? That's it. Okay. Yeah, the beetles aren't too bad. All right, so let's undraft everybody. And... Quinn, do this. <laughs> you're not getting out of it just because. He's like, I'm going to eat a snack. You're going to do it. That's what you're going to do. Snack. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, I've got a headache. <laughs> I'm hungry. You're lucky if I don't make you move this now. Can you tell me how to live my life? It's like still in the way. Man, I'll tell you what. <laughs> If I did all that work and you still can't move it, yeah, it just seems like it doesn't matter what I do. The yeah, door is in the it way. It just hates you. Yeah, I don't know, guys. I don't think that works. It won't let me move it at all. I can't even get it a little bit closer. I don't know, guys. We'll have to take a look <laughs> at that later. I'm not messing with it anymore. Not playing your games, flamethrower. <laughs> Yeah, I'm not entirely sure. It's like the traps are causing problems or something. I don't know, guys. I mean, I guess it would be better to have like a a guided corridor for the flamethrower. Well, but... eventually I did want to, like we are going to improve this some, mm-hmm. but yeah, we've been so busy. That's always the problem. I'm always like, oh, the monsters are such an inconvenience. Because I got shit to do. Yeah, we got all these different things we got to do. I can't be stopping to fight your ass. Uh, speaking of things to do, let's go ahead and start constructing over here now. Uh, somebody told me about this fertilizer. Uh, where did we set that up to be stored? The poop. Right here? Yeah, the poop. That rather than turn it into f uh, fertilizer or using it as fertilizer, because it's so easy to get food, uh, that it's it's better to instead use the, the poop to make, uh, to turn it into fuel. Now, does that make sense? Probably not. You can burn poo. <laughs> sure, but not <laughs> for everything that uses fuel in this game. That you could just put poop in there. It's uh, you can't really do it like that. Uh, let's go ahead and get this. Uh, these walls started up here. So, which walls are we doing? Are we just do. Did you say we're gonna do planks inside? Or? Yeah, I would use planks inside. Okay, so let's go ahead and start with the the bedrooms. And so, somebody told me what the large room is. It's, if I remember. Like five by four? Maybe five by four. We wouldn't be able to do that though, guys, without having increased the entire size of this. We're already at the end of uh, autumn here. Yeah, it's just not gonna be a priority, guys. So instead, we're just gonna do what we were gonna do, which was, I think, the four by three, right? Was that what yeah, we had? Yeah, I think so. Let me see here, because we got let me just kind of double look at this here. Double check this. Yeah, we got 12. So yeah, we'll do the four by three. We don't really need to have, uh, need to have the full bonus. I mean, it's helpful, of course. And yeah, we'll stretch that across like so. And then let's go ahead and finish up these rooms. But yeah, we just don't have the time right now. To get the full bonus. Now let's place the plank doors. Do you put windows in your place? Uh, yeah. Each of my people have a window in their room. I see. So that when it gets hot, we can just open it up. Does the window cause problems when it's uh, wintry? I mean, if it's open. Okay, but if it's closed, it doesn't if cause it's problems? Closed, it doesn't cause any issues. Then we could put a small window in. I uh, probably don't want to do a metal one. Yeah, just a wooden one. Let's do a wooden one. Right in the middle here. And we should hold on to that so we can do more than one. There we go. Okay, so they'll get that constructed and then we'll move their beds in there. And then we can deconstruct all this here. Now we could have built off of this rather than building it all from scratch, but I didn't want to do that. Ember's just sleeping in the middle of the day. We did wake her up before she was ready to though, so I guess she's got a bit of an excuse, but. She's like, I'm tired, okay? I'm irritated that we did all this for nothing, man. I'm spending all that time working on it, and you can't even... Psh. 
Yeah. Like it seemed like it was going to fit. Yeah, it seems like... Yeah, it's just all messed up, man. All right, well, whatever. So might as well just uh, copy this and put another one here. Well, now it could be because all the bodies. <laughs> could be. Yeah, maybe that's what it was. Oh, oh no. no. Who died? <gasps> Bessie, Bessie died. Pregnant Bessie died. How'd she die? Does it tell us? No. Animal flu. Damn animal flu. I wonder if she spread it to him. Let's take a look. So we gotta go get another female. Ah, that's a bummer. Yeah. Alright, so we'll have Bessie set up to be butchered. Oh. And then, yeah, that's really sad. That's awful. It's awful, man. Bruno must be devastated. I'm sure he is. Uh, there's a large female. Oh, damn it. I didn't mean to go all the way back <laughs> like that. And I'm over here trying to sign, and I haven't even... We need to set Well, we need to bring that baby home. Yeah, I mean, I guess we could set that one up to be tamed, too, but you can only do it one at a time. We just don't have... We just don't have the time. Bruno needs his kid. Yeah. Uh, so let's go ahead and dismiss that. And we know there's no research queued, but <laughs> we are busy. So busy. So it looks like Ember's the one taking care of this. You know, that we have a uh, Quinn set to mostly craft. Connor's gonna go. Yeah, poor Bruno. Does, does he f have any feelings about her dying? He doesn't care. He doesn't care. Do they not have relationships with their other animals? I don't know. It doesn't seem like it. Well, that's unfortunate. Yeah. Yeah, that really should be a, a factor. Did we ever get that meat? What's going on with this? Did it just disappear? Did somebody put it away? Somebody stole it. Oh, we got dried meat. We can go tame that dog. Oh. If it's still here. Let me put that dog. Where's the dog? Might not be here, though. It's been a while. Dog. I'm not seeing it anywhere. Is that it? That shadow? Here's some raw meat. Oh no, what is it? Hmm, something was killed. Dag. I'm not seeing the dog anywhere, Jinx. Ah, <sighs> fucking dag. Maybe we'll see another one. Yeah, it's a bummer we didn't have the dry meat when the dog was here. I'm looking for it, but yeah, I'm not seeing it anywhere, guys. <laughs> Poor Jinx. She not get her dag. Maybe we'll come back. Or maybe that's it. Dead. That looks died like poop. Of loneliness. Oh, that's not a dog. I wish you could, like, mark stuff. Like, yeah. hey, I don't want to lose this thing. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm looking out here to see if there's... Any other dogs? I'm not seeing anything though, Jinx. Yeah, I think he's gone. It's been a while though we'll since he came. Have to look during the day. Yeah, we'll come back and look during the day. He's he was kind of dark, so he might be difficult to see. Well, it's daytime now. Our people should be getting up soon. Laura's gonna go tame right now. I'm not seeing it, Jace. Yeah. I, I kind of feel like it's that that died. A heat wave? In fall? In fall? Really? Okay. Outside temperatures are 46 degrees higher than usual during this disaster. Okay. I'm, I'm over here putting winter clothing on everybody. Well, that's not good. <laughs> <laughs> not good at all. I should probably wait to put that, uh, whatever we just designed, a leather chest. That's what we currently have. And so he should be telling her something else. Yeah, he's working on that now. Well, I guess the leather chest isn't all that hot. So we could put that on whoever needs it. Let me see. She has something, but yeah, it's about to go bad, the spaceship jacket. So yeah, we'll have her put this on, but let's let her, oops. Let's let her uh, finish up what she's working on. There we go. And then have her put the leather vest on. 
Okay, yeah, so you should get that on. And Pain then... Failed. Hmm. And then we have the coat as well. Oh, she failed at it? Yeah. Maybe she's just sad because Bruno died. Maybe. What happens when they fail? Uh, it depends on the animal. Mm-hmm. Like, I don't think the old friends do anything, but the other ones um, have a chance of attacking you. Mm. Okay, well... The little hammery head-looking ones. You're not done yet. <laughs> <laughs> Get back out there. We'll Get set it to we'll saddle. set it to tame, but she's probably going back. Yeah, so she's going back. So then, what we might as well do then? I was waiting to do this because I wanted her to tame, but we can go and have her throw on this coat. So we have the coats crafted, and so now we need pants. So the next things would be pants. Yeah, because I think we're done with both of those. So which pants should we get? Um. I'm thinking like the leather leggings for, yeah, like maybe leather leggings for the, uh, the warriors. They're not quite as warm. Sure. But yeah, I think that'll work. Plus they work during the, uh, summertime and then like two thermal pants or something. Yeah, that'd work. So yeah, let's do two of these and then we'll do two of the thermal pants. There you go. And then we'll want to uh, change the priority as well. There we go. And we'll also take a look and see what we have being used. So you do need a leather here for this. Somebody's thinking that you didn't need leather for these. You do, you have to have a leather and a, a cloth selected. And then, yeah, then that's fine. All right, so he'll get to crafting those whenever he finds a time, I suppose. And then we'll want to get this finished up here. They get the beds moved in there, and then we can go and work on all this. It's a beautiful fall day. Yeah, it's nice out. I mean, 55 degrees is not nice, but yeah, it's not the too bad. The heat wave did us right. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it warmed everybody up. Just what they needed. Yeah, they sleep at such weird times. We really need to adjust that. Yeah, I set my people's sleep time. Yeah. How much time do they need to, to sleep? Oh, um, Tame and succeeded. I think the way that I have it is I have like five blocks of designated like sleep time. Mm -hmm. And then like some blocks that are just anything. So if they want to sleep, they can. Or if they want to do something else, they can. It's oh, mostly, it's... though, to keep everybody away from the, the one guy. Yeah, the one Xander. guy. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Because I hate him. All right, so he needs to be led. So let's have her do that. So lead off. So what are we going to name her? Um, little one. Little one? <laughs> this isn't the baby. This is a large female. Oh. Uh, is it large, though? It's not as large as Bessie was. True. Though maybe I'm only thinking of, like, big pregnant Bessie, though. True. Um. Shit, I don't know. I did not come prepared. <laughs> I didn't come prepared for I didn't know names. Bessie was going to die. Oh, these all need to be closed, don't they? Let's go and set that to be Closed. Closed. The last one here. Alright, so we'll have that all be closed, but let's go ahead and start setting up the, the beds to be moved over. So who do you think should get which room? I don't think it matters. I feel like Connor and Laura should be next to each other, right? Are we shipping them? <laughs> <laughs> so let's move this over here, and this time let's make sure we're putting it in the right place. in the right direction and then oops let's have Quinn in the middle here and we'll keep Ember far away from everybody else because she seems to be the less liked of all of our people yeah she seems to be the one that causes the most like trouble she's grumpy she's kind of grumpy yeah 
She's just trying to keep everyone safe. And then the last one, Laura. She'll go right here. Right there. So we'll get those all moved over. It's not really a priority deconstructing all this, I suppose, but it would be nice to have the wood. We have a lot of wood right now, though, so. So yeah, we'll get the beds moved. We got thermal bridges. Thermal bridges, nice. So wait to put those on. I'm a little bit worried about everybody getting like too heated up when it's still not uh, cold out yet. So yeah, we still have all the pants that we put on. So we'll do that later. Connor's going drinking again. <laughs> How much Always wine is even left? Drinking. How's the wine supplies looking? I know we're still making wine. As long as we keep making it, he's gonna keep <laughs> drinking it. Why is he at a risk of meltdown now? He just had a drink. <laughs> well, that don't make you any less... What are they doing? Why are they sleeping on the floor like this? Oh, what are the beds assigned as? That's embers, quins. I said they can't reach the bed. Did they get locked in or something? Huh. Wake up. <laughs> what is he doing? Connor went to his bed. Laura's bed isn't ready yet. Why did they sleep on the floor like that? What are they doing? Come on, guys. Oh, she's wow. already pregnant. That wow. was quick. Bruno, you're the one over here giving everybody animal flu. <laughs> Why did he not sleep in the damn bed? What is the matter with him? Go over there and sleep. Wow, what is wrong with <laughs> Why do I have to, like, got a baby force you? On. Yeah, I got a baby, guys, to... Oh, they get a plus one, nine from the private bedroom. Maybe they were just pretending to sleep on the floor. <laughs> I don't know. We caught them. <laughs> Ember's pregnant. <laughs> <laughs> She's got the animal flu. <laughs> they slept in private bedrooms. So they get a plus nine from that. But yeah, I think they get more if it's like a large bedroom. Okay. How about we name her Daisy? Daisy? Okay, well, you feel like you gotta, she's got to have a name before she has a baby? Yeah. Okay, so let's... She can't just be mom. She's got an identity. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we'll get her named Daisy. All right, so Daisy's sleeping. Quinn's sleeping, Ember sleeping, and I guess we can go and start getting the rest of this designed here. I almost want to start doing the floors first so they don't hate it as yeah, much. Yeah, they will get really cranky if you don't mm -hmm. spruce it up a bit. So, yeah, how many uh, floor options do we have? Can you click on these and get new ones? No. Okay, no. so this is what you have. That's it. I see. I see, I see. Well, I don't have the arrangement for the kitchen yet. I feel like you got to have carpet in the bedrooms, right? Though it requires yeah. cloth. That's what I put in there. I put the skin bark carpet for the ladies and just the soft carpet for the dudes. I see. Because it matches their purple beds. Okay, I guess that makes sense. We'll do what Jinx does. See, so yeah, i put these in here for the ladies. Oh. What is going on here? What is going on? Oh, I don't on? have it oh. selected anymore. <laughs> there we go. And then we want to do the soft carpet for the dudes. And so we want to go like so. And then I need to hold it when I click on that so that it stays up. I just forget to hold it. There we go. So that'll give them that room bonus there. And then here we want to go and start setting up like a, a separate area for the kitchen is what I'm thinking. Mm hmm Go off in this corner or something. Yeah. So yeah, we'll want to get everything set up there first so we know how big it's got to be. Uh, so we're looking for the heat. No. Production? Cooking stove. Okay, so we'll put the cooking stove like, I don't know, maybe right here in the corner or whatever. Is there anything else they need for the kitchen? No, just table and chairs. Yeah, obviously you need all that. Well, we'll just move all that from over here. 
So yeah, we'll get them building that. Doing the carpets. They're going to like their carpets. Like, ooh, this is nice. I guess they each need their own uh, torch as well, don't they? I don't put a torch in there. Because they're sleeping? Yeah, they just sleep whenever they're in there. It doesn't bother them at being dark? No. Okay. Or if it does, I don't pay attention to it. I mean, it's not dark right now, so I guess I can't really check it. But yeah, plus nine is nice for being in the private bedroom. They had that share bedroom before. So the creature comfort is the one they get from having the carpet, right? I think so. You just woke Connor up <laughs> putting his carpet in. Who does carpeting while somebody's sleeping? <laughs> Damn. It's cold-blooded. It's like, I have a task to do. <laughs> Alright, so it's going to start getting cold soon, guys. But yeah, I like the stone floor there. Like, I wish they would be happy with that. Mm -hmm. Alright, so we're getting this built. Getting all the parts for it. Looks like uh, Ember's going to take care of that for us. So she's going to do that. And then that table's often being used, so <laughs> we might have difficulty moving it. Is that the table we want? I mean, it's not the nicest looking table. Is there better options for tables? Yeah, those are the smaller ones, and then there's the bigger one. Um, the oh large yeah, large table, table, my bad. What do you think we should get? Metal, stone, wooden? Well, the metal one's nice, but I don't know that I would waste the alloy on it. Alloys on it? Yeah, alloy. <laughs> <laughs> uh, nice. <laughs> yeah, I mean, that one's all right. You can do the stone. You got plenty of rack. Yeah, this seems kind of ugly, though. Yeah. We could do that. I just moved my wooden one. <laughs> I mean, I'm fine with the wooden one. I mean, it's been yeah, sitting the outside. But... fine. So, yeah, let's just go ahead and move that one. So, uh, nope, 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 that's not right. We want to move it. Hmm. Let's see how we want to do this. Because I want them to be able to sit in this area. Hmm. I would put it off to the left of the stove there. Like right there. Well, I was going to close this off and make it kind of separate. You oh. know what I mean? I don't like, think all that's necessary. But I want to. Okay. Sure. I want like a separate kitchen area. That's going to contain more heat in your kitchen area. True. I don't care. <laughs> <laughs> this whole big room's going to be hard to heat up anyways. Yeah, we're going to move that. And then let's get these moved too. Right there. And hopefully this works out all right with the move in these. So we get that one moved. And then this one. And yeah, I don't know if, uh, I don't know if there's anything we can put right there. Cause I might want to move the stove simply to have it be in the middle. Really? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to make this look nice, Jinx. Oh, okay. Not that mess of a house you got. What are you talking about? My house is nice. Jinx's house is really nice, guys. She spent way too much time on it. No, I didn't. <laughs> I spent the just right amount of time on it. <laughs> so, we got glowing mushrooms. You can put glowing mushrooms next to the stove. That'd look nice. Yeah, I suppose you could do that. Because, yeah, the wall's going to be right here. Oh, I have shelving next to my stoves. Shelving? For the food. Oh, yeah, that makes sense. Yeah, we can put the shelving right here. And this is Eventually, there will be, like, a refrigerator and stuff that you can get. Yeah, this is, I think, right where we need Showings. shelving. So that's going to have to get moved, too. Damn it. Let's move this. Over to here. Ember, quit your bitching. Yeah, they just whine. No one wants to hear it. So much whining. Oh yeah, before it gets too cold, let's get Laura to train the baby. Baby's dead. It died without its mother. Yeah, we took all the, the adults and it died. Wow. You're a monster. Do the cows just all take off? Do they oh, herd off somewhere right. else? No, that's not a baby. That's not the same ones. 
Oh, there is a baby. Where? Up there, a little potato. This one? Maybe it got I mean, adopted. Maybe, but I don't think so. Yeah, maybe it got adopted. That's we what could, we're going to go we with. We could pretend. I like pretend. Whoa, look at that big herd. Big herd? Oh, wow. It's probably over okay, here. Okay, that's where it went. It got adopted by somebody. People were worried that we wouldn't have enough <laughs> meat. <laughs> that we'd kill, they'd all get killed. Look at all of them. There's so yeah. many cans. Yeah, there's a lot of them. I guess we could send somebody off on a thing. Yeah, go see what that loud bang was. Okay, uh, let me just get this set up real quick. Well, I notice this is cleared. Uh, we're going to do the, the storage for the, the food. So we'll do the wooden... Uh, it's not working. That's outside. Okay, here we go. <laughs> Alright, so we'll get some food storage right here. And we'll restrict that to just the food. And so it looks like, is Ember going to take care of that? Oh yeah, I forgot we are going to send somebody. Who's going? I don't know. I guess because we're not taming the baby, Laura can go and she's all super smart and stuff. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> And also have Connor but do an expedition. But she's scared. Do you really want the genius going and dying? <laughs> then you'll be lost. Uh, do they have her. a risk of dying? I assume so. I don't know. So yeah, let's go ahead and send somebody off here. I just want to see if there's any information about who's best. Doesn't look like it. I don't know if happiness matters. <laughs> Connor's super happy though. Yeah, we'll have Connor go. Why not? He needs it to get out. Bye, Connor. Have a good trip. Is all that wood still over here? <laughs> well, nobody ever moved it. Got some uh, leather leggings leather are pants. done. Uh, unfortunately, that is going to be the end of today's episode, guys. We're getting the inside here done. Still a lot more to do. Got to get the wall. We'll get the wall stretching from right here. Kind of close this off a little bit. And then, uh, you know, we need to get all this stuff, the work stuff, moved over there. And then maybe somewhere for them to chill out, sit down, I guess. A game room area, perhaps? You have, like, fun stuff for them to do? Uh, but yeah, we'll get all that taken care of next episode. Hope you did enjoy this one. If you did, make sure you leave a like on the video, subscribe to our channel, hit that notification bell, and leave a comment. Do hope to see you on the next one, and thanks for watching.